Hello, my name is John Reimer, Senior Technical Marketing Advisor, uh, representing the Large Cabin Part 25 airplanes for Texron Aviation. In the year 2000, I had the privilege of getting my initial Citation 560XL type rating, and since then, have had the ability to fly all the Citation 560XL iterations. We're very, very excited to show you the Citation Ascend Cockpit today. The heart of the Citation Ascend Cockpit is the all-new G5000 avionics suite that is horizontally aligned uh, with one MFD and two PFDs. The PFDs are able to do a 60-40 split screen, which gives you the ability to have actually six different screen configurations. So you can overlay airport diagrams, departure procedures, approach plates, arrival procedures, all simultaneously if you choose. The G5000 avionics are controlled by four individual GTC controllers that are standard on the G5000 installation. Each pilot has one outboard GTC and each pilot has one inboard GTC. They are in a tilt configuration and also ergonomically located for easy accessibility for both pilots. We've actually added push to talk switches on both outboard GTCs right beside them for easy frequency changes and one-handed procedures when talking with air traffic control. The G5000 avionics suite in the Citation Ascend is also complemented by full regime auto throttle system. The auto throttles provide envelope protection for overspeed protection, underspeed protection, and they're fully integrated from takeoff to landing. The other nice feature about the auto throttle installation in the G5000 of the Ascend is it participates in the emergency descent mode. In the event of a cabin depressurization, the airplane will actually turn off course 90 degrees. It'll descend to 15,000 feet as the throttles come to idle and accentuate that descent rate. The G5000 installation in the Citation Ascend was an all new design for the airplane. Since then, we were able to take a lot of the systems and integrate them into the G5000 development of this cockpit. That alleviated a lot of valuable real estate and ergonomically locate the touchscreen controllers. In fact, we were able to eliminate over 75% of the original toggle switches from the first Citation XL to what we have today. The Citation Ascend G5000 installation also features the all-new GWX8000 Storm Optics weather radar. This radar features a 12-inch antenna and also gives auto-scanning features to give a fully volumetric picture of the storm ahead without the pilot doing complicated math and complicated tilt functions. The pilots can then spend their attention on navigating and circumnavigating these storms. This radar actually features four times the colors of a traditional weather radar. The storm optics radar also features hail prediction and lightning prediction as well. A very nice new design feature of the Citation Ascend cockpit is the all new windshield design. We've transitioned the airplane from a six screen windshield configuration to a four screen windshield configuration. This gives us multiple advantages, better visibility out of the cockpit without having the screen frames of four individual windshields, as well as anticipated reduction of ambient noise in the cockpit. We also eliminated the rain removal shroud and the nose avionics cooling fan, which also provided for less ambient noise in the cockpit. The four windscreen design also provides 99% UVA and UVB ray protection for both pilots in the cockpit as well. In addition to the quiet cabin technology in the Citation Ascend cockpit, the airplane comes delivered with two noise-canceling Bose headphones. Those headphones plug into two six-pin jacks that are built into the Citation Ascend cockpit. In addition to that, each pilot has two USB-C outlets that are in the forward part of the cockpit for charging devices. Behind the pilot seat, there's a 115-volt universal outlet and two additional USB-C outlets with an option for a second 115 volt universal outlet and two more USB-C outlets behind the co-pilot seat as well. The Citation Ascend comes standard with dual FMS. It comes also with synthetic vision, standard ADS-B in, ADS-B out, and is fully capable for CPDLC, FANS 1A, and ATN B1 installations. The airplane comes standard with a satellite cockpit transceiver, which can be used for cockpit communications, as well as the Connect Weather feature from Garmin. The Citation Ascend features the all-new Pratt & Whitney Canada 545D engine. Unlike the predecessor 545 engines, this is more than simply a FADAC change or a software change. The 545D engine 
actually features material changes to the high pressure section and the high pressure turbine as well. Pratt & Whitney 545D engine also comes standard with their diagnostic fast box. The fast box, when paired with Textron Aviation's Power Advantage program, allows Pratt & Whitney to extend the TBO of the engine from 5,000 hours to 6,000 hours and the hot section inspection from 2,500 hours to 3,000 hours. We've also changed the exhaust mixer nozzle of the engine, and that has added approximately 100 pounds of thrust to the engine while reducing the operating temperatures and making the engine more fuel efficient. These fuel efficiencies have made the Citation ascend a 1900 nautical mile range aircraft with four passengers at high speed cruise. With the Citation Ascend's new MSG3 maintenance review, we're fully anticipating best-in-class maintenance intervals at 18 months or 800 hours. Part of this is due to the Ares system on the aircraft, which actually tracks up to 9,000 different parameters on the airplane to help with maintenance diagnostics and troubleshooting. This, paired with the Linksys data transmission system, will actually transmit a lot of this data live to your maintenance team on the ground. This will keep the airplane out of the hangar and in the air as much as possible. Thank you for joining me today on the cockpit tour of the Citation Ascend. Hopefully this tour has introduced you to the amazing technology that has been integrated at the Citation Ascend and you can see what truly sets this aircraft apart from all of the other aircraft.